just got to make sure I got everything set up right on this end. So making sure you guys are seeing this correctly. Let's see. Let's see. I think we got it. We're just checking here. Just testing to make sure we are streaming. Okay, it looks like we're streaming, but why is my... Oh, there it is. Excellent, 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 excellent. We are good to go. Let me see here. Just trying to settle, just trying to settle up so I can read chat. We are going to be climbing today in the competitive ranks. I'm already at platinum. I've made my own kind of brew here. We're looking at um, two cut down, four dark ritual, four fatal push, three inquisition, two thought seize, two relic of regenerators. Three card sale, free booter, three orcish bone masters, three shieldred's edict, three graveyard trespasser, <clears throat> two Liliana of the Veil, three Phyrexian obliterator, two shieldred the apocalypse, the one ring times two, one bajuka bog, one castle lock plane, two hive of the tyrant, seventeen swamps, and one of the taken numa abandoned mire. This is my own little build that I made up. So let's see if this is worth a shit. It's interesting. I can see. I can see the chat there, but I can't see the chat on my end on my setup. So let me see here. I'll probably just set a tab back and forth occasionally. And now that we're in Platinum, we have to win a lot more to get ranks. It's not as easy as the previous ranks. Um, this hand's got a, this hand's not terrible, it's not the best, but it's not terrible. Okay, this is a bad matchup for us, I think this is Storm. I'm relatively certain this is Storm, actually. Yeah, yeah, we actually might be dead next turn. Not even joking with you. Well, actually, hold on. We have we do have interaction. We do have interaction. Okay. Oh, okay. What the fuck is this? So we were about to get channeled. That's fucking crazy. At least we're not gonna get channeled, and we have a shot now. I have three graveyard trespassers. It's a little nutty. Not exactly what we need right now, to be honest with you. This fatal push is like not doing nothing in our hand either. To be honest with you. Okay, at least he didn't draw a land, to be honest. Because that would suck. Okay, I figured that out actually. 
actually. Um, there's like no incentive, I don't think, for us to exile anything right now. I'm just gonna play the largest thing I can to beat his head in. Right, we can't even hurt him right now. This this card's so stupid. I I play it in this deck because it's so stupid. But. Mono black sack, no sir. This is this is my own kind of mono black control build. It revolves around the one ring and shieldred combo for massive value. Because if you you play this, it protects you. Um, and then shieldred, you draw and gain a whole bunch of life. This is really kind of like a value deck. It's like mono black mid range basically. Right, we can hit him for a pretty sizable chunk here. I'm gonna exile. I think he can play the the artifacts from his grave. Oh, he played the other ring, right? I didn't Let's see. See how dumb this shit is. But yeah, I'm just gonna. I'm actually. I thought. Well, this is a channel deck, so. But I don't think it's Belcher because it doesn't have um, the lands for Belcher. But I, I took this out of his hand turn two after he tutored for it. So, And after all these cards he's drawn, he probably has what he needs, I would assume, to, to go off. Um, I, th I don't know what he'd be doing with Channel if he's not Storm. Nope, yep, there he is. He's Storm. He's a Storm player. Yeah, I don't know if we lose here. Um, oh, yeah. Is it an artifact? Oh, yeah, we, we lose here. He's probably going to go oh, artifact, 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 tendrils of ad, ad nauseum, and completely destroy us. <coughs> Oh, okay. He's actually going to do Aetherflux Reservoir instead. Okay, we're not dead? Holy shit. That's very lucky of us. Um, yeah, we got to make this count then. Wow, we're not dead. That's crazy. I thought we were done for. So, so you're saying there's a chance. Maybe. I'm a little nervous. Oh, no. Yep. This is probably where it's game over now. Yep, because that's free. So it's kind of like Storm. It's eggs that he's playing. With the, the, we just gotta hope he like hits a land and out of all his draws he can't do anything like that, but it's so slim that that actually is gonna happen like he more than likely will be able to kill us here I'm almost certain of it yeah artifact storm exactly which is crazy because I think I, you'd want to play blue for paradoxical outcome. Bounce all your shit except Aether Flux back to your hand and have a, have a good day. If he's playing that, we might not be dead. This turn. I mean, it's also just another draw spell, so. I'm, I'm strongly leaning to that we're dead this turn. Yeah, this deck struggles against Storm. Uh, they've got Show and Tell sneaking the the in sneak attack in this format. Um, this deck can can do good if it gets all of its hand disruption in like its opener. 
But if you keep a balanced hand, like like we kept a kind of a balanced hand, it's really hard to to do much against them. To be honest with you, ooh, now his four drop artifacts are free. Ooh, he's getting. Close. We're probably yeah, we're probably just screwed. Oh god. Oh god, yeah. Yep, that's one more one more buddy. You can zap us. Okay, you're gonna get I mean the thing is if he gets locked up here he's we're still screwed. No way. Wow. He was one off, but there is like literally nothing we can do because he's got protection uh, from everything from the one ring. But I mean I'll I'll swing to exile his yard, but uh, let's see what else we can find. Maybe we can find something that'll help us here. Okay, Bowmasters actually might be able to do something here. Since we can't, we can't target him because he has pro everything. We're only swinging to exile things out of his graveyard. Does no damage, no damage, no damage. <coughs> but that is it. Yeah, unfortunate. Not a great matchup for us, but I've also got a couple other decks for this format. I've got uh, this, and I've got Jund. Yeah, he probably just has Karn in there to go tutor for another artifact to play, or I bet I bet he has um, another Aether Flux able to be tutored out of his sideboard. Because in best of one, you can have a seven card sideboard for stuff like Karn. <coughs> okay, this is turn two for Lex Phyrexian Obliterator, which is pretty good with turn one Thoughtseize. So this is a solid hand as long as it's... Well, we'll see. We have a good first pick here. Okay, this is also Storm. So I gotta think here. His turn one, he wants to do Dragon Rage Channeler to fuel the graveyard. But Underworld Breach is like a big payoff card. So this is actually a hard choice, and I'm going to actually go with the turn one play here, I think. And we're going to go ahead and just shit out an obliterator. Because this like fuels the engine, and he can respond at instant speed, so he can still get a trigger off if he fatal push. Yeah, turn two for Xian Obliterator is pretty solid and has won me a shitload of games. We'll see what's good enough to win this one. And my deck is also poised in a good place against this one because I have mainboard graveyard hate. <clears throat> Phantasm, interesting. We're just gonna get rid of it. for five we didn't draw a land but we drew Liliana Liliana's pretty sick draw here if we draw a land next turn if he plays a creature it'll be really pretty but his hand is struggling here okay another one of those um if he ends his turn I'll still probably end up playing my removal yeah. 
I just don't want him to have anything. Okay, that's good. That's good draw. Good game. So yeah, it's like it's like mid range black with uh, like some decks literally just can't do anything against the Obliterator. They're just like, oh, well I can't exile it, so I'll just get my ass beat by it. Sending out my link for a few places. Mm. I'm going to say sure. Oh, this is actually probably a really shit matchup for us, too. This is mono green uh, ramp into um, yes, yeah, it's, it's field of the dead ramp basically. I mean, he's got four cards in hand. This could be pretty devastating. Hmm. This lets him get more for us, but this lets him find something. I hope that's the right choice. Yeah, turn two obliterator is hard to beat. Who's gonna ramp more? I wish I had land destruction, I really do. Oh, that's Yikes. Uh this is only one of the few targets in the deck, so I'm just gonna hit it. We need to save these for um Prime Times. Oh jeez, look at that. Alright, he's gonna enter and I'm gonna make him sack it. Yep, we're gonna go ahead and just uh, uh, get rid of him right now. And I'll rat it, get rid of the bird of razor too. My purpose is greater than my He's got the one ring and we are screwed. Drawing this second dark ritual was not good. So yeah, he's got the one ring, and you'll, you'll see how stupid this card is, dude. It's literally so, it's so triggering. Because it wins games all by itself. Like, that's why I run two of them, and that's why people are running Karn, to go find it, like, all the time. Because <coughs> look at it. It just draws cards, like it loses you life or whatever, but it gives you protection from everything when it enters. Yeah, it's so stupid. I, I really, really wish they never printed this card. And so he's gonna yep, he's gonna keep the one with less counters on it so he doesn't hurt himself as much. And hopefully we draw Shieldred, but that's pretty good too. Oh, we can't even target him right now. Because it's pro everything, so... That's how good it is. You can't get targeted with anything. The way we could win this probably is drawing Shield Grid, but he's getting to the point where Field of the Dead is about to be pumping out two zombies a turn. And he's about to have... Uh, he's probably He probably has prime time, yeah. We'll go ahead and probably just scoop it up here. But yeah, if you if you draw if you draw that ring, man, it's everything. And in my deck, when I can do dark ritual into the ring on turn two, it's insane. Here, I'll just show you real quick. I call this deck "fuck this meta" because I really hate this meta. It's bad. Don't get me wrong. Like all the decks in this format are really fucking broken, and I feel like this is one of the more fair ones to play. But play two cut down, four dark ritual. Four Fatal Push, three Inquisition, two Thoughtseize, two Relics, because Luris is popular, Storm is popular. There's a lot of decks that give a fuck about the graveyard. Uh, 
uh, three card seal. This is for sneak and the other decks I can't beat. Orcus Bowmasters, three, three Shieldred, Edict, three Gregor Trespasser, two Liliana, three Obliterator, two Shieldred. This is the combo with the ring because you can draw like a fuckload of cards and instead of losing life, you gain a shitload. And then just more Gregor Hate in the land base. But then I could also play Jun too. Like this is a this is actually a good deck to play in this format too. And I might go back and forth between the two. I only play one Orcish in this deck. I know it's like a weird build. But this is my own personal Jun. This should be a new fucking broken planeswalker. Let me show you who that really needs to be, honestly. If I can, once I can, I'm going to replace probably Chandra with this thing. This thing's so stupid. Like, that's, they, they just swear, they just print more and more broken cards all the time. <coughs> but I got, I got to the rank below Mythic last season, so I just want to get to the Mythic rank this season. Prolapse is our opponent's command. Well, that's special. Man. I don't know, man. Luris? Oh my gosh, there's no payoff for these arc rituals at all. Man, I'm about to really. This is questionable. I'm, I'm getting rid of Bajuka Bog. <clears throat> okay, this is actually a little tough. I think we get rid of the turn one. Yeah, he's going to play Eidolon for sure, like, no doubt. Watch him have drawn Ragamon or something stupid. Watch, watch. No, okay, he just he just wants to be able to build us. So I'm going to go ahead and just Thoughtseize. Didn't draw land, but this this land can function on one hand, I think, for a minute. Bump of the Night. Uh, we'll get rid of Eidolon. So he's playing Luris Burn. This is another popular one, which is why I run also a shitload of relics and all that good fucking shit. If we're getting our ass kicked. Um, I did something stupid and kept one land, so can't really be shocked here too much. Okay, okay, okay. Well, this is good, because we can actually thought these Luris out of the hand and realize we're fucking dead as shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Didn't draw any resources. Very unfortunate. We're not getting double skewered? What the fuck? Bro, are you smoking crack, dude? Why did he not double skewer us? Why? Okay, that's why. We're gonna lose a skewer now. That was probably a mistake on his part. I've seen Rakdos burn, I've seen Mardu burn. Oh, dude, it's everywhere. No, we're dead. We're, we're dead, actually, yeah. We're dead. If we would have drawn resources, we probably might have had a chance. I might switch it over to Jund here. Just for a game or so. I've got Jund, I've got my own burn, I've got four color power answer. This is another build of mine. Ponza. Ooh, we can play some Ponza. This is this is dirty. 
This is fucking dirty. Oh yes, this is a fucking phenomenal hand. And he fucking did it. Okay, hopefully he doesn't have a Thoughtseize, or like this hand is definitely not as good. Come on, be not a Thoughtseize, or a Ragavan. Come on. Mother... Oh my gosh, it's always either or. So now... Now instead of Stone Raining, because he has a, a source of mana... Or do we Stone Rain? No, no, Stone Rain for sure, I think. Cause it'll suck because he'll get a treasure. But, uh. Hopefully, he gets something like garbage. You can play that Blood Moon, buddy. Um, we don't care. And your deck doesn't care much about that Blood Moon either. To be totally real. Okay, but see, he's probably not going to pop mine. Oh, wow, he is. He did not learn his lesson at all. Maybe he has to because he has a card to play. Okay, this is another burn deck. A lot of burn tonight. Shit, guys. We're going to go with a red source. And I'm probably going to end up playing... Blood Red Elf. Hopefully get removal or something good. Removal, heck yeah. Get rid of Ragavan. And then hopefully, like, he'll just play a threat we can lava coil or something. Oh. Oh, he's not dashing it? Whoa. Okay, that's fine, actually. We don't care. Yeah, this is good for us. Because we can exile this and then play Fable. This card's like 25 bucks in paper, dude. It's wild, because it's played in, like, it's played in a couple Legacy decks and shit now. We're not letting you get us, sir. Okay, not drop. Oh, oh, that's so good. No, we're not. We're not. Blow up the blow up the blood crypt. That's fine, sir. We don't give a single shit about that. Because we can keep him off Lurus. We can keep him off black. And he probably doesn't play that many lands, to be honest with you. Okay, that's fine. We're going to get a 2-2 and a 4 in the turn. 2-2. Okay, yeah. 4-3. And now we can also copy our 4-3. To really start fucking beating his head in. I mean, he can... He needs two removal spells. Let's see if he reads the card. Okay, he read the card. He did read the card. I'm going to pretend this is something good. And I think we win the race now. I hope we win the race now, anyway. This is so a little stressful. Okay, yeah, we definitely win the race now. Does he have a blocker? Pretty sure this is a W at this point. Okay, no problem. Yep, good game. Easy land destruction win. It sucks when they have Ragavan turn one though against this deck. Because it almost like makes your turn one stern rain like pointless. For real. Or turn two stone rain, sorry. <coughs> oh, 
Oh, we're fighting a diamond. Mm, my hand sucks. Way better. Fingers crossed, I don't get screwed again. Okay, there's a land, thank goodness. Stifle! Oh, watch, watch. That's the worst shit, watch. Thank God. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, if we got stifled there, it was fucking over. Which is actually why I want to build a blue-red, um... What the fuck is this? What the fuck? Oh, he's giving her a stone ring. Yep. No, oh, what the fuck. Good game. Yeah, okay. You got one card out of my hand, you think it's over? This is absolutely nice. I didn't see this back before either. That's a good one, Bloodbraid. Stone Rain. Oh, it's a grot. Well, you gave me Dark Knots, so. I'll trade. I really hope I beat this guy's ass with the juggernauts he gave me. Nah, we're fucked actually. Like, uh, we could draw Carnage Tyrant. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we could draw Carnage Tyrant. But he's got such a wide board now that we might just be fucked. He's just gonna keep swinging a lot. What? Okay, okay, he's crazy. He's crazy. He's an insane person. Okay, I don't care about that. God, dude, look, look at this board, bro. It's so fucking huge. I guess, right? Like, yeah, we'll pay. Good game, huh? Let's see. Show me the good game, sir. Okay, because I think I can survive this. Block five, so we got three, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, so hold on. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So if I block here, that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then we die on the backswing. Yep. Oh, that was stupid. That was so dumb. <clears throat> yeah, if he didn't take Stone Rain out of our hand that game... He wasn't going to get it. Okay, this is a fucking really good hand if he doesn't have, like, Thoughtseize turn one. Fingers crossed. Okay, we are. We are in the clear. Or, like, uh, some form of counter magic this early would be also bad. I'm actually going to do green-red for this forest instead of green-green. 
Okay, cool, 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 cool. So yeah, green, red, because we have a lot of double red here. That's actually, that's actually rough as fuck for us. No, we want red, red, because we played this. We're trying to make the best of it here. We're gonna, we're gonna get rid of Thalia. We can still play a mid-range game. Like, if, if this is a Hate Bears deck, like, because it's... Okay, pumpkin spells are in your turn, no problem. Whenever one more creatures you control. Okay, so... I'm going to go ahead and do this with its kicker. And blow up our first land. We're going to let them keep the pain land. And not attack with anything. Okay, for the land, no big deal. Okay, can't play more than one spell turn, very annoying. I will actually kill that. Spell. If we draw a land, we can do. Okay. I will. Oh, fuck. We should have. Yep, we fucked up. No big deal. Um. Yeah, I'll just do this then. Because I should have I should have killed that, then played the land. We made it oopsies. But. Oh, well, what is this thing? Do I care? I'll, I'll, I'll actually block that because Phoenix is... Yeah, okay. If he takes Stone Ray, we still cast it. He'll probably take Carnage Tire, I know it's in. not gonna hit us though because we have what he's dumb oh my gosh poor guy wow well we both made an oopsies then it, it all happens you know we're, we're human we all fuck up spoil this so now i have to pay pain and i will actually go in Don't block, don't block, don't block, don't. Yo, that's crazy. Yo, this man's smoking meth. Oh no, he might have an answer. <laughs> oh my gosh. Two, four, five, six, so don't finish taps. Okay. We need one more mana for Carnage Tyrant. Okay. That's that's one more mana, I guess. I feel like now is when you don't want to draw lands. Yeah. Can't counter it. Nothing. Here he come. Hear that big boy come. I think I care about your lizard. I don't care about your lizard. <clears throat> Obama care. Obama, I don't care about shit. If you know where that's from, you're a G. Oh 
my god, are we dead? Bruh. Bruh. Oh my god. That's what I'm talking about. This format is so dumb. Bruh. There is nothing I can do. Uh, I guess swing Carnage Tyrant and he has to trade, like... But I'm fucked, though, because he's just going to do it again. He's got Natty Order. Oh, fuck me, dude. I don't know how we do this. Like, Okay, no, no, no. There's one particular way I think we can win this. Okay, I don't... Okay, hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I think he has to, he has to trade, and then he can't play shit else. Okay, yep, you have to trade. You have to trade, right? You don't have to trade? No, I guess not. Well, he's dead, right? No, he goes to four. We got our Phoenix token, but he can't play anything. That's what's most important here. He can't play anything. This has Vigilance. Damn, dude. I think we're still fucked. We're still fucked by this stupid thing. Dude, dude, this is this is the Wild West. This format is so stupid, but I think we lost. I genuinely think we lost. Hold on. There, there might be a way out of this. Because if he still can't play anything... Well, no, he grabbed uh, he grabbed Atraxa. Cause, so what he did... Was he natural ordered, sacked his dude, grabbed Atraxa. So this is the best we can do now. He's just going to sit here, trade Phoenix into Atraxa. He's not going to get anywhere. Okay, this is the answer we needed. Two Carnage Tyrants. Because now... We'll get in for 7 because he won't trade. He'll gain 7 because he'll hit me. He won't draw any land that lets him play shit. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Yep, he's going to do it again. You're fucked, buddy. You're done. This is your turn. Because now I swing with both Carnage Tyrants, right? And it's over. Because now he has to block. Yeah, you just swing both of those, right? Because if I swing that, he'll gain seven. Yeah, just swing both Carnage Tyrants. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Bro. Bro, I'm so butthurt right now. Okay. Like, I think he's still screwed, though. Like, I think he's still screwed. Because that's 14 damage. Yeah, you're, really? You're, why are you double blocking one? I guess it doesn't matter. Can he pump? Bro, this dude's pissing me off. Nah, Tyrant has a uh, Trample, Hexproof, can't be countered. So he's going to three. If he draws a, a second, we're fucked, I think. Like, I, I don't know what's going to go on here. Because I, I keep blocking with Rekindling. Like, this is just going to keep happening. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Mmm, <laughs> Blood Moon. Blood Moon. Thank you, Blood Moon. Thank you, Blood Moon. Take this fucker and throw him in the fucking trash where he belongs for playing that horse shit. Okay. What do we get? Bloodthorn Flail. Okay, let's see here. I keep playing Ponza, or I can switch it off to John. Go back to Mono Black. Play, I'll, I'm gonna try Jund out. See if we can win. This is actually the deck that I got to Diamond with last season. 
This is what I played the most of. This hand's slow, but I like it. <coughs> oh, fuck, dude. If we're playing against control, though. Okay, that's fine. This is a huge draw against control. I'd rather do this. I know I could play either of these, but I'd rather do this right now. You like Spell Pierce? No, Brainstorm. Okay, so that's so unfortunate because he's going to hide good shit from us. He's going to hide the shit we don't want to... He, he's going to hide what he, we don't... Ugh. He's going to hide what he doesn't want us to take. But at least I'll know what the fuck he's playing. And if it's Control, we may as well kiss this game out the window. Um... It's looking like control, but I mean, like he's just spinning in his wheels like three brainstorms. I don't give a fuck about that. This this card's gonna eat his ass alive. Oh yeah, that's card. That's gonna eat his ass alive. We're gonna wait for him to pop a brainstorm, and we're just gonna throw in our fucking bowmasters. <laughs> Never mind. He got his own bowmasters. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, with that, we're going to just blow up his Bowmaster. And now, he if he activates Brainstorm, he's going to get his ass kicked. This is why I probably should play more than one of, of that in my deck, honestly. Because his hand could be very, like, well, screwed now. Two of his cards are dead, the rest are lands, like... I got all the mana except double red for Chandra. That's annoying because we care about Tarmogoyf and I mean he's got a graveyard for Oh he's gonna exile his? No, that's fine. As long as he has a graveyard, Tarmogoyf is good. Um but I'm gonna play Blood Red Elf. Right now's pretty good. Token trade, probably. Yep. But then he can only activate it one more time. No! You're just gonna let it die? Really? Okay. He wants to get more activations out of it, I guess. What's he trying to mill for, I wonder? This thing's so fucking stupid. Yeah, now he can activate his brainstorms freely. I mean, he did give us a buff, though. Like, we can smack the shit out of him right now. Hold on. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. That's almost lethal. 2. Yeah, no, we might go for face. I think I'm just gonna go for face. I don't think he's matter enough to, to really give a fuck about him. Face is the place. Ooh. Very nice pull. Good game. And we'll leave Assassin's Trophy up. Chandra's. Bro, you're dead, right? Like, I'm pretty sure homie's dead. I don't know why we're still playing.
And whatever you put on top, like, that's fine. Go ahead, put it on top. I don't care. I'm gonna shuffle it away. Either draw it now or shuffle it away. What do you wanna do? There it is. But yeah, I used to play aggro all the time, and now I'm like kind of more of a mid-range guy. This is a pretty good hand. Oh my gosh, yes, Mulligan again, please. Do it again, do it again, do it again. Ah. Oh. When they mulligan, dude, and you've got like a hand like this. Oh my, oh my fucking, what the fuck is this? What in the fuck is that? What is that? Combo bullshit. Is that like fucking? Oh, what? Why do you think this hand was good? I am so confused, bro. Deeply, deeply confused. Don't tell me you got a counter spell. Thank you. Yeah, I don't want to know either. I, I really don't want to know what's about to happen. What? Yeah, I'm, I'm fucking perplexed. Like, let's see what else he drew. Just lands. Like, what? What the fuck is this, dude? Lands and nine drops. Okay, maybe we get some more info here. It's it's gonna be some degenerate combo bullshit that wins in one turn, so let's just hope he doesn't draw anything worth a shit that like enables whatever combo this is. He didn't put anything in the yard? That's concerning. There it is. It's show and tell. It's just a different color of show and tell. I, th I think that's it. We're fucked. I mean, maybe? Maybe not, actually. Hold on. No, we're not, we're not fucked, actually. We're fine. That was kind of stupid of him. Uh, I'm not going to discard anything. Um, I'm going to Assassin's Trophy that. So we're fine. Yeah, we're literally fine. Just show and tell we were able to Mirror Breaker a uh, way to keep Jar Soul. I mean, if it, watch that be a second show and tell. That's how this deck is, I swear. I swear. If they banned this card right here, the format would be 100,000 times better. It is so fucking dumb. See, now he's screwed. No three drops in our yard, unfortunately. Four, five, another one of these. I think we'll play this. Because it gives us mana. Let us play a 
uh, Bloodbraid Elf next turn. I mean, I hope we just draw a land, because then we can... Well, it's game over anyway, I think. Um, decline. Except turn not legendary. Oh, but we'll just do this. Yeah, that's just game over anyway. Like, I don't know what we're doing. Yay, we beat Show and Tell, the dumbest deck ever. He was playing a bad version of it. He's playing a really bad version of Show and Tell. Because the good version, you have like Demonic Tutor, you have fucking Omniscient, so you can play your old deck for free. That was kind of a, a shit version of the deck. Because I swear, that deck I have like a million percent loss rate too. Can't keep this, I don't think. We draw a card. Yeah, this is good. I hope that was right. Is it eggs again? Tarmogoyf likes uh, artifacts like that, though. So we're at Sacred Bobble, so I can play my Goyf for a million. Oh, whoa, what in the... Oh my gosh, bro. Sneak attack again. I'm about to jump off a bridge. Like, this is what I'm saying. This, this whole format is sneak and show and tell. Draw the 8-drop, play the 8-drop, wow. At least he's gonna take him time to do this. I mean, fuck, dude. He just drew two more cards. <sighs> lord, 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 lord. 4-5 Tarmogoy should do well if he doesn't have a way to counter this. Like, I don't see two blue. But if he has like a one mana, one blue counter magic, I don't know. Do you have removals? No, okay. Liliana can probably win us this game. I desperately, desperately need to draw. We'll counter that. Like, that's no, no shit, right? But then Tarmogoyf gets bigger, so whatever. Tarmogoyf's huge. We just gotta pray for, like... He'll play Sneak Attack here, duh. All right, we need the Assassin's Trophy Cascade right now. Bolt, not it. But actually, is he dead? No, he's close. He's really fucking close. Okay. Did he draw something worth it? Let's see, let's see. Watch, watch a 12-12 come out of nowhere. Okay. Wow, we fucking beat another sneak attack deck. That's fucking uncommon. Wow. I mean, John's been working. Let's just keep going with John. Playing against a lot of weird shit this evening. Jingle pause. 
This hand is gas. Oh fuck, it's it's sneak again. Watch, watch this. It's sneak. Oh, I bet money it's sneak. The good version. But he's gonna hide the shit I need to get rid of. It's so irritating. But I'll be able to tell if it's sneak or not right now. Yup. Yup. This format is fucking so trash. I swear to God. I'm dead this game. Like, I, I'm not winning. He's got three tuners. I guess we take the payoff there. Well, no, brainstorm into thoughts he's a smart because, see, he, he's taking the cards out of his hand he doesn't want me to take, and he's putting them on top. So what he just did was probably take show and tell out of his hand, put it on top. He's going to tutor for another payoff card. So if I don't draw another thought sees, I'm fucking losing. Okay, the game is over. Uh, the game is now over, probably. I wish, I wish it wasn't that dumb, but it really is that dumb. Okay, another tutor. Let's see what we got. We're not dead yet, which is actually fucking really fucking shocking. He's giving me a chance. If I draw hate, if I draw some hand hate, which I didn't. Yeah. There. I would say it's really slim to none chances that he doesn't have. Sneak plus payoff card ready. I would say with all the tutoring he's done, we are... We're in trouble. There it is! Show and tell! Yay! Just like I called it. It'll be like a 12-12 or a 7 set. Oh, just, yep, Omniscience play their whole deck. Yeah, this is the good version of the deck. Yep. The one with 12 tutors in it. We'll see. We'll see. I'm, I'm going to play this out. Because that's fine. Like, if you draw cards, I will. Oh. Nah. It might be over. I don't know. If he draws cards, I can just like snipe down a Traxa. He's about to tutor for his whole deck again. Yeah. But no, that this is why this format, in my opinion, is really bad right now. Because of this deck. This deck is turn two win, turn three win. Pretty, pretty fucking consistently. Yeah, he's tutoring something fucking scary. Oh, there it is. Approach. Oh, yeah, appro yeah we lost. Yep, approach, dig, approach. Wasn't that a fun and interactive game of magic? Wasn't that really exciting? Man, I'm sure, I'm sure glad we got outsmarted and outplayed by our opponent he really is a the superior magic player for being able to play show and tell on turn three and uh into omniscience and play his entire deck i'm really glad we got outplayed there guys it felt really rewarding to play that match if you play show and tell you are a piece of shit you are a piece of shit No, for real. <clears throat> mm. 
okay. We can literally dump our entire hand right now. I'm not gonna dump my hand right now because in case I draw uh, one of our key four drops in the deck. Also, when those when it says it's playing an ad for you guys, it's not like taking the it's not taking a lot of watching the thing, is it? It's just on the side. Ooh, shit. We should have been Bowmasters, dude. He's about to take our Bowmasters right now. Yep, go ahead, buddy. Saw that coming from 800 miles away. Gonna get some extra burn in here. And then I'm gonna get as much as I can out of this relic. Bro, is this bro? He might be playing sneak too. Or show and tell. Sneak, show and tell. Okay, game's not over yet, thank goodness. So we really don't know what the hell he's doing. Ooh. We do get her upgraded here. He's almost dead right now. That'll help us to be honest in here for a little bit. I can close out the game next turn with the Hive Tyrant. Um, yeah, first we're gonna make sure we're not gonna get blown up. And then Dark Ritual and the Hive Tyrant. He was playing that shitty ass deck! He was playing that shitty ass deck! I freaking told y'all! Oh my gosh, that makes me so mad. I'm so glad he got his hand screwed, though. I'm so glad he got his hand screwed, though. You deserve it. You deserve it. You play the worst deck in existence. Okay, that's fine. I don't really care about that. You'll die next turn. He either, like, watch this. If he draws show and tell, I'm going to fucking cry. I'm going to fucking cry. Because show and tell, he'll win the game. Like, I'm going to cry. Watch this. Okay, okay. Fuck me. He's got three chances to draw this shitty-ass spell. You know he plays four of them. He's taking too long to think. It's it, you don't, You don't have it. He might have some fucking convoluted way to try and find it, though. Come on, you piece of shit. Come on, bro. Don't do me like this. This is what this dumbass deck does. It just draws it, bro. Like, he's, take, uh, he's taking way too long to decide. He can't have it, I don't think. Watch. Oh my god, what is it, bro? What is it, bro? Oh my god, bro! This is so fucking horseshit! He's gonna find it now, and he's got this dark ritual mana and play it and win the game. Yo, you've got to be fucking kidding me! You've got to be fucking kidding me! Oh my fucking goodness. What in the fuck, dude? You're a piece of shit. Oh my god. He didn't do omniscience, so he can't do nothing else. No, 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 no. Bans show and tell, bro. Attracts is fine. It's this. This is the problem. Leave Attracts alone. Ban show and tell. If he didn't have show and tell, like, the game's over. Son of a bitch, bro. Son of a bitch.
son of a bitch. There is nothing I can draw right now to even... I think I'm fucked. Yeah, like I'll play I'll play rain or whatever, but he'll play his whole deck. I mean, okay, hold on. No, cause he'll just Yeah, here like like I'll I'll try, bro. I'll try. I take out payout card. He he's just gonna search for payoff. You know what I'm saying? Like He's just gonna tutor it. He's gonna tutor the, the thing he had in his hand. This deck is so bullshit, bro. They need to ban this card. It's really not entertaining to play against every single game. Yeah, you can see what I'm saying? He, like, yeah. He just tutored for another payoff. There it is, and yep. So, it's just so obnoxious, dude. It, t it takes absolutely no skill to play a three mana. Yeah, there it is. Approach. Where's the draw spell? Yep. Okay. This is just so obnoxious, dude. No more distractions. Let's make this quick. These have to be dead cards in his hand. Like off you go. There's a there's a sliver of hope. I'm talking about a sliver. And I think he just draws it here so we lose. Yep, there you go. It's just it's just like very limited interaction. It's so annoying. Turn three, show and tell, game over, woo. Or like just do, literally do nothing the entire game. Then play show and tell. And it's over. As you saw. God, it's just so infuriating. Because, like, if you play best of three, that deck just doesn't win. But no one plays it there because it doesn't win best of three. It can only win when there's no answers for it. Because if you want to beat that deck, all you got to do is play uh, four Dampening Sphere and three more Hand Hate cards in the sideboard and the deck loses. Because he can't play cards for free anymore. Mm. I'm digging turn to Shieldred. Turn that was icing on the cake right there. Jeez Louise, bro. Time is two or less. Yeah, man, it's bad, like... Is this, is this over? Like, uh, this is a new deck, I've never seen this shit either. Tainted Pack Luris, like, is it just Singleton... This is like some fastest Oracle bullshit, watch. We're about to lose next turn, it doesn't matter. So he doesn't play any cards that match. So this this is a singleton deck right here. Is what we're seeing, a, a real singleton deck. Maybe not? Okay, there's Tainted Pact. 
So... Bro, what in the fuck? Well, Tainted Pact again, like, I, I'm pretty sure this has got to be some fastest Oracle combo deck. Because he just got rid of 90% of his deck. Probably just Tainted Pact in response. Sensor, okay. I don't know, he's got me confused. I mean, if you did ban a Traxa, though, you probably could have a much more f fair show-and-tell deck that didn't have as much fucking room to just abuse. So if we try to do Kite Sail, he'll just counter it. I mean, he's going to counter whatever, so we'll work this year. Really? Wow. Okay. Uh... Is that an instant card? It is instant. Bro, what in the fuck is going on? Can you tell me what is going on here? It's gotta be fast as a workout, bro. I literally don't know of another card, but like that means he just drew fast as Oracle. And th there's fast as Oracle right there. So how do you get Thassa's Oracle back? Oh, there it is. We lost. Right? Yeah. It's just all this stuff. is like, dude, the combo decks in this format are so fucking annoying. Uninteractive as fuck. Hmm. I've got to figure out a way to... Yeah, he's just like, he just self milled into Thassa's Oracle. I saw that coming from a mile away once he started doing it. Hmm. Maybe Ponza. Combo deck can't play the game if it doesn't have mana, I guess. But then we have a hard time against uh, aggro and burn. So yeah, it's like it's really hard to play something that hits all corners of the meta. Ugh, I mean, like see, he, there's so many ways to get fucked here. But it's a good hand, so I gotta keep it. But thought sees kills us. Um, removal kind of kills his hand, so a little nervous for real. If we get Thought Seize, it's probably GG. Young Wolf. I'm pretty sure this is some degenerate sack combo deck. Where you get the card that doesn't let you get counters on stuff. So Undying allows an endless sack trigger. Like, I'm fairly certain that's what this is. Fuck. There goes our ramp, so no turn. No stone rain. Hmm. Blood Moon would be a really sick draw for us.
This is some weird shit. Kind of sucks. Uh, we're not getting anything other than lands right now. I mean, we're not taking big damage still, but it's just annoying. And then Death Rite also kind of surpasses our destruction abilities. But next turn we can start playing Acidic Slime. We got two. I, I, maybe we can pull this out. I don't know. Maybe this isn't a combo deck. This is some weird shit. I really, I, I see this and I think combo. Yep. Here we fucking go, dude. I swear. It's important. It's always, always some dumbass shit. You don't play fucking D tutor unless you're a combo deck. So the best we can do is just take him on black, like I think, and it still don't matter because you got death right shaman. So you gonna play whatever the fuck it is. Do I want to make it a 2 2? Not really. That sucks, yo. No, I was on a faster clock. Now I think I will do it. So I can double trade again. Yeah, I'll go ahead and make that. Because I can literally make that trade again. We need a good card here, like Chandra. Fuck it, that it's never anything half decent. Always getting fisted over here. I'm gonna discard it to this next turn. Okay, that's something that probably needs to die soon. Really? I was like, you're gonna get rid of Shaman? Crazy guy. I guess I want to keep a slam because they're both death rush. Bro. Holy hell. Watch me discard these two lands into more lands. Watching it. Watch it. Watch, you ready? Okay, wow. Lucky us. Ooh, next turn, dude. We get the fucking... Oh, yeah. The Kiki Jiki Slime copy shit. Dude, I know he's going to have so many sickness next turn, but as soon as we can start Kiki jiki <laughs> Acidic Slime, he has no hope. Okay, he got back on black. He's about to probably death right for some mana. I've got to kill this fucking death right shaman. Okay. Oh no, he is. He's doing it for my lands. What do you got, bro? What is it? You got four mana potentially here, so. I'm real curious. Oh my god, bro. It's always some broken shit. Oh my god. I am so fucking heated right now. Okay. Well, we're not dead.
Damn, I really wanted to copy Acidic Slime, bro. I really wanted to copy Acidic Slime. Does he have Trample all the time? No, he just has Haste. Um... Oh my god. I can't go one ping away from him either. So... Because now we're two pings. We're two death right pings away from death. Instead of one. Bolt for death right. And hope to stabilize here. Yeah, it's just, yeah, it's not a Traxa. That's a valid point. It's not a Traxa. I don't think we'll have haste, so we're gonna swing. Being at three really just sucks though. Phyrexian Tower, Carney T. Alright, I think he might be actually dead as fuck. Can't mess with Carney T, bro. You cannot mess with Carney T! Yes. I'm just treading water in platinum right now. Hmm. Wow, that's actually pretty strong. That's actually really strong. Good cyborg card. Do I want to keep playing Ponza? Sure. We fought another paw person earlier. Oh, fuck yeah. Turn to a blood moon? Yes, please. This is what I, did. I made this deck for. Oh, don't tell me you're going to be mono green and make my turn to blood moon pointless. Watch it. It's going to be mono green because of my blood moon. Son of a biscuit eating bulldog man, I'm telling you what. It's always the dumb shit. It's always the dumb shit. We're gonna get beat up, but Blood Red Elf's coming. If we draw our enchantment, we can pitch it. Oh, a reason! A reason to play Blood Moon, okay. Oh my god. Aggressive. Uh, I need a bolt. Thank you. You see how I just talked to my deck like that? See how I just summoned a bolt to the top of it? Oh yeah, there's a reason to play Blood Moon now. Son of a bitch. Good lord, I gotta I gotta play Phoenix or I'm just gonna get my head bashed in. He's like stunned to this. Fuck. Well, he's gonna natural order and the game's gonna end anyway. Watch. Watch. Okay, fuck. It's still terrible. Oh my gosh, bro. Is he gonna Oh bro? Ooh. He should have probably swung there. Yeah, he should have probably swung there. Ooh, 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 I don't like that. I don't like that. Uh, I don't like that. Oh, we're fucked. We're dead. Yeah, that's a true elf deck right there. Yep, just like I said, we're gonna have problems against creature decks and aggro decks of Ponza. I swear, dude. Whatever I pick, it feels like I just get paired up against the counter for it. Because there really was barely... There, Blood Moon wouldn't have done shit. No, actually, no. Blood Moon would have made it to where he couldn't play Pac Master, but it wouldn't have mattered. 
Because he could have tutored for the cord for another lord, and we would have died anyway, so. Uh, this deck still needs a little love before I actually play it. I need a few more cards. Let me look at this and see what I'm, like, rolling with here. I know I don't have the, um, Eidolons, which are pretty important, honestly, for a burn deck. But, I mean, I've got some Ws with that before. I, I don't know. Probably just go back to Jun for now. As a curve. Thoughtsies. Inquisition, same thing. He is probably taking Liliana of the Veil. Called it. Chandra's pretty good. I'm playing against the mirror, maybe? I think we are. That's crazy. That's just gonna die. I gotta get removal out of his hand. And I will... Okay, I'm gonna play I'm gonna play two life. Because if he has Ragavon, I don't want him to get a treasure and I can fatal push Ragavon. Or whatever else he plays, and then hopefully land next turn into Chandra. Yep, we are playing the mirror. He's playing blue to Delta. He might even be playing four color, five color. Mm, so far just John. Wish for top you gotta be fucking shit, dude. Well that's a dumbass idea of you, right? I, I need to draw a hand hate right now. See, like I could uh I tutor the hand hate to my hand, he can tutor tutor back, you know what I'm saying? I just gotta hope that I can basically out outperform him. You wanna go, tough guy? This will be easy. With uh, hopefully whatever he tutored for isn't super disgusting. But I don't wanna give him a second tutor either. Okay, let's see what the hell is in your hand. Really? My friend, you are a fucking crackhead. I love Croaks to do. He's so fucking good. Love this card. Storm? It's fucking Storm? Well, I'm definitely not giving you this fucking talisman back now. 
We, shit, we might be dead next turn. Here it is, here we go. I mean, that, that fucking kills our Goyf. There's the second spell. Third spell. Fourth spell. Motherfucker. Yep, we're gonna go grab fucking. We lose. He's gonna have tendrils of ad nauseum and kill us. Well, I don't know why he's going so overkill. You could literally kill us right now. This format is the worst. I swear to God, dude. Congratulations. No skill. All the brain deads play like two card combo decks. If you drank paint as a child, you probably play show and tell decks. If you chewed on windowsills as a child, you probably play storm. This is a. This is not a great Luris hand. It's not a great hand in general. Neither is this. But I'd rather keep this than uh, what we had previously. <laughs> oh my god, it's even worse, dude. Fuck. There goes our turn one. What? I would have taken the shaman. Play our turn to Fable. We're probably fucked already though, because we got we had the mulligan and we got hand hate, so. That goes our way to play it. I swear dude, this game gets me so fucking hot sometimes. Yeah, see, he's going to try to... We just got to make sure Luris doesn't really stick. Because this hand's kind of just literally treading water. He's not really doing shit right now. Double Bolt could actually fucking murder his ass. Have we go... No spell pierce? Probably spell pierce. Now when he plays Luris, I'm just going to trophy Luris and probably skip off. Oh my god. Okay, it's a 2-2 right now. He could make it way bigger. I think he wants us to. We need an answer for Luris, so we Assassin's Trophy this. So that when he plays Luris, we can bolt it. But oh my god, he's going to get a Death Shadow back.
Because when he plays Lurus, he gets priority again. So he can play a spell for free before he before I kill it. That's the damn problem with Lurus. What's left, buddy? So now we want to draw probably uh, the three drop. What's his fucking name? Jarsil? Jarsil, I think's his name. Fucking so stupid. I'm so over this shit. So we need to draw, or we need Bloodbraid to hit um, Assassin's Trophy. Well, no, then it won't matter anyway. We need her to hit Jarsil, honestly. Jarsil is like our way out, I think. Eh, that's, not, that's not the way out we need. This game is, in fact, probably over. This will be able to play Luris. I'm surprised he hasn't played Luris yet. Well, he don't fucking need to. We got two Death Shadows, so... Let's get him. I haven't gone anywhere today. I said that we started with one and now we're down. It's so fucking hard to climb at this rank, dude. I either get stuck in diamond or stuck in plat every season. I've almost been to mythic like twice. Hmm. This is what I really want to play, I think. When I, hold on, let me see if I can find it. I need a few more mythic wild cards and it'll be operational. Where is it? Hold on. It's that stupid uh, field of the dead deck. Yeah, here it is. I just need three more of these and two more of these because it seems like if you aren't doing something really, really broken on turn two in this game, in this format, you're just not even gonna have a chance. Just won't even have a chance. All right, guys, it's probably my last game. I'll run a quick ad and then I'll end the stream. It's been wonderful coming back. I got four viewers, which is actually way more than I was expecting to have. I was expecting to have zero since it's been like a year since I streamed. We'll go out with a bang. Let's see if we can fucking burn someone's ass alive. Mm, this hand is shit though. It's really fucking slow. At least we're on the draw, and he bolted himself. That's not good in this matchup. Probably, he'll probably play Eidolon, I would assume. Ooh, yeah, but take your damage, bro, please. Take this friend of mine. 
Okay, discard my. Yeah, this is getting a little sketch. I don't think we want to draw her next turn, for real. Okay. Think we'll play our Dragon Channeler. Always, we're surveil, surveil, and scry. Yeah, that's actually exactly what we want to deal with Eidolon, I'm pretty sure. In the next turn, we can. Okay. Now you're playing Eidolon, right? Yes. Okay. And then he's dead now. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's just dead now. Vermeer is always stressful. Ta-da! But yeah, this deck desperately needs uh, Eidolons too. But no, guys, thank you guys for uh, joining. Thank you guys for tuning in. Uh, I'll definitely be streaming probably tomorrow. I'm going to try to stream a lot more lately, trying to get, get some more content in. I'm making more content on both my channels, so check me out on YouTube too. I got Gadros Games on YouTube. I got The Shibboard on YouTube. If you want to give me a subscribe there. Uh, yeah, thank y'all for watching. I'm going to run a quick 30 second ad, 60 second ad, 30 seconds. And if y'all want to watch it for me, I'd be gratefully appreciated. Take it easy, everyone. Have a great night. Good night.